Today, I'm going to teach you an easy way to automate your link building outreach, get more free backlinks, get higher conversion rates than ever before with outreach. And it's absolutely insane what you can do with AI. These are the same techniques I've used to build hundreds of free backlinks. Let's check them out right here. And these increased my site's traffic. But the sad thing is I did it the slow, boring way. So don't make my mistake. Today, I'm going to show you a much smarter, faster, and better way to automate the same strategies I'm using to get tons of backlinks. But you'll use ChatGPT and AI link building as you'll see in this video. So let's just get into it. So the method that we're going to be using today is called Sniper Link Building. If you've never heard of it, don't worry, I'll explain. Two years ago, I did publish a video tutorial about it, but you can actually do it way faster than ever before using ChatGPT. So how does this work? Essentially, you find sites to reach out to, you send them a very personalized message and you keep following up. And the beauty of this is that you don't even need to send the message via email. So you don't need to gather email addresses or pay for fancy prospecting software. You can just quickly send a message on social media. The message will look something like this. You might also say, how do you find sites to reach out to? I'm going to show you a way to get an unlimited number of link building prospects in about one minute. But first I have to show you this technique because I just discovered it today and it's very powerful. So how are we going to do this? Well, first of all, you're going to go into chat GPT, select plugins, select web pilot, as you can see here. And from here, what you're going to say is scrape the URLs below and give me a list of some specific information I could use to personalize an email outreach campaign, including authors, topics about information, what they talk about, who they are, et cetera. And you just plug in all the sniper link building prospects you want to get a backlink from, right? So for me, for example, in this tutorial, I was reaching out to lemlist.com. I got the backlink right here using this personalized method. And if it was that situation, I would plug in lemlist.com plus all the other sites that I want a backlink from. So we're going to hit OK like that. And what this is going to do is basically gather all the information that we can use to personalize our outreach message so that it doesn't look like we're just some randomer off the internet who's writing some BS about an outreach email. We're actually creating something that's very, very personalized and specific to the person we're reaching out to which means that we get more backlinks and more results from the emails we send. We're way more efficient with the time we do. And you can see that it's generating all this personalization based on the website, actually scraping and researching for them. And bear in mind, how long would that take a VA if you hired them to do the research for you? It'd take you absolutely ages. So by doing this, we automate the research, we save time, we can scale up our link building, and we can get better results overall. Easy peasy. Now it's time to create the message. How do we do that? Step two is to say, now use this to create a personalized outreach message. First line must be personalized to the person. I'm not going to read this whole prompt out because it's pretty long, but if you want to get it, it's in my free course. Or feel free to pause the video and take a screenshot. Basically, you're going to say, based on this information, create a very short, personalized, friendly email. Write up a follow-up. In the second email, write up a song about the person because that's going to make you stand out if you send a personalized song to that person based on their personal information. And in the third email, do a knock-knock joke about them that must be easy and obvious to understand. The punchline must be very clear and funny. Make the joke easy to understand, etc. And basically what this is going to do is create a very, very personalized outreach campaign that we can use to reach out to that person. Now we could reach out to them via email if you want to reach out to them via email. Honestly, if you want to get the best results with the sniper method, to maximize that and get more results with outreach, I would recommend instead using Facebook, LinkedIn, social media, etc., because typically you'll get a better response. For example, for me personally, I don't look at every single email that I get, but I do check all the YouTube comments because it's important to get feedback and understand more about my audience, etc., and help you. So we've got the message here and you can see that it's very, very personalized. So for example, in the subject line, it's got my name, but it's also got the name of my book. So it's very personalized to me there. And then it talks about my YouTube channel, specifically the topic that I talk about. Then the next line is very personalized as well. For example, it's a play on words because my surname is Goldie and it calls my work pure gold, etc. And then it's very short and straight to the point, which is the best approach. But it basically says, I run a site in the same industry as you, the SEO realm. I've got a high domain rating for we could collaborate. How about a guest post for a backlink exchange? It's win win. And that's basically it. So you can create very short, straight to the point, easy to understand outreach emails that are more personalized than anyone I've ever hired to write them. Plus it's got a cheeky little joke at the end. And here's how crazy the personalization on this is. It's literally taken the words from my website, publish and pray, which I mentioned right here. And it's created a joke around that specific play on words, right? For example, 
I tried the publish and pray method with link building, ended up praying for a new method. So essentially, this is more personalized. You can imagine this would take hours and hours for a good copywriter to actually create the email. And by doing this, you're going to boost your conversion rates, which means more backlinks, better relationships, better outreach methods, and you're just taking the game to a whole new level. Now, this took one minute to generate. Imagine if you scaled it up a hundred times. If you send out a hundred of these emails, that's going to be way more effective than sending out a hundred skyscraper emails. And then in the second email, this is pretty cool as well. So it said, a tune for the SEO maestro. Very complimentary there. I wouldn't call myself an SEO maestro. It said it couldn't resist penning a little ditty for you. And then you can see that it's created a very, very personalized song for me. Just to follow up on the second email. And on the third email, it's created a little knock knock joke personalized to my industry that's actually relatively funny and better than most knock knock jokes I've seen. So using this process, how many more links can you get? How many more conversions are you going to get? A lot more, right? The percentage is going to be absolutely crazy. And bear in mind when you're scraping the URLs, you don't have to do this one by one. You could scrape 10, 15 or 20, draft up all the personal information you need to write the email. And then you could craft 10 or 20 or 30 different emails and scale up your sniper link building. So it's just way more powerful than it's ever been before. I mean, for example, compare the difference between these emails that we're writing right here versus this one that's like, hello, dear, I want to post two do follow backlinks on your website. What's your lowest price? Which one's going to elicit a more positive response? Obviously, it's going to be this email funnel. And if you scale this up, that's going to compound over time and get you more and more backlinks. You're more likely to get free backlinks and everyone wins. Bear in mind as well, you could use this for sales outreach. You could use it for getting more affiliates, et cetera, to your website. There's many ways to personalize this outreach process and basically grow your business. It doesn't just have to be for link building. By the way, all of these prompts I'll put in my free course. You can get access to that in the link building section. Now, let's talk about the prospecting. You might ask, okay, that's great. I can write the outreach emails. I can get them to convert. I can get as many backlinks as you want. But you might also be wondering, okay, who do I need to reach out to with this email to get the backlinks I want? So for example, if you want to find the right person to reach out to, you would use this prompt right here and you say, right, for insert your prospects. So for example, juliangoli.com, who's the best person to reach out to about backlinks? And do you have their social media profile links? What ChatGPT is going to do is scrape the internet, find contact information for this person that you're trying to reach out to for the website. It tells you who's the best person to reach out to. It tells you where to reach out to. So for example, their YouTube, their LinkedIn, their Twitter, et cetera. And so now you can easily figure out, okay, where do you contact that person? And also how do you contact them? AKA the average messages we've crafted before. Now you might say, okay, but how do I figure out which websites I can reach out to? Easy enough. You can just go onto chat GPT4 and you say, right, use WebPilot. Give me a list of 200 SEO websites and you can replace SEO with whatever industry or niche you're in. And give me a list of sites that I can reach out to and offer a backlink exchange. And also make sure you ask for the raw URLs because you want the list of websites that you can then paste into ChatGPT later to figure out where can you contact them and also write in the outreach. Now, it's not always going to return 200, but you can try and get as many as you want. Or you might have to expand your niche. So instead of saying SEO, you might say, okay, find me marketing websites. And there you go, it's finding you some marketing related websites you can reach out to and ask for a backlink. Are all of them going to say, yes, you can have a backlink? Probably not. So how can you get more results? Well, what you can also do is if you extend your page settings on Google to a hundred results, and then you just type in the topic that you're trying to get backlinks for, there's literally hundreds of results that are going to come up, right? As you can see here, just literally an endless number of results. Now, some of you might've seen this before already, but basically what you can do is you can pull up Harper AI, and then you would say, extract the raw URLs based on the page text, gives you a list of URLs from this page, as you can see. And then you've got even more prospects that you can reach out to. And obviously you need to do some filtering, figure out, okay, which ones are the best ones. That's easy enough, right? It doesn't take long. You might say, maybe this method just doesn't work. Like people are never going to link to me based on a message I send on Facebook. I mean, if you actually look at all three of these pages right here, they all contain backlinks to my website and they were all built with social media messages, right? I didn't actually do any sort of email outreach used to get these backlinks. They were purely through sniper link building and approaching the right people and and messaging them on social media. You might also say, okay, but if I type my keyword into Google, isn't it just going to pull up loads of competitors that would never link to me? I mean, if you look at this case study where so links a lot actually link out to me, you see the backlink right here. I mean, they're literally a competitor, but the thing is, 
for me personally, I don't mind linking out to competitors. And obviously they don't either. I think it's a limiting belief to think your competitors are never going to link to you because your closest competitor can also be your biggest collaborator. And loads of people in the SEO industry have reached out to me and helped me more than I could possibly ask, even though they're competing with me or selling similar services, et cetera. So I think that idea that competitors won't collaborate with me or build links to my site, et cetera, is actually a limiting belief. Obviously not every competitor is going to link out to you, but also most of the time people aren't your competitors. You know, if you've got 1% market share and they've got a 1% market share of like a billion dollar industry, you're not really competitors, are you? You're not even big enough fish to be competitors. That's how I think, I think it's just better to be abundant and collaborate with people and make the most out of the opportunities that you have. And that's the belief that's served me best. So just to recap on this whole video tutorial on how to use this sniper link building process to get free backlinks using AI and chat GPT. So first of all, you get the prospects. You can either do that with your own knowledge of who the best people to get backlinks from are in your industry. Otherwise you can use chat GPT as I've already shown you. Then you're going to send them an outreach message, which you can also do with chat GPT and make it very, very personalized and specific to their website. Next up, you're going to follow up, but only once or twice. Don't spam them. You don't want to be a spammer. You're just following up once or twice. That's it. And I think a song. A very personalized song would, like that would work. A bit of humor like that would work nicely. Either way, follow up, be consistent. And then finally, do this consistently at a large enough volume to get more backlinks to your website. How do you send the message? LinkedIn, Facebook messages, etc. The whole point is that it just must feel personal. And then, honestly, email is not going to feel very personal. Social media is. You might say, how do I know this will work? Well, it's based on the techniques that I've used to build hundreds of free backlinks from thousands of outreach messages are sent from my link building agency. And you've already seen the links we've got with this method. Finally, you might say, well, will this work with every prospect that I reach out to? No, obviously not. But that's why with link building outreach or any type of outreach, whether it's for sales, affiliates, link building, etc., you play the volume and numbers game and basically never let effort or volume be the reason that something doesn't work. And bonus points to you, if you combine skyscraper outreach with sniper link building, because then you're getting backlinks from two different methods and you can scale up and get as many backlinks as you want. And again, this is a process that's getting me tons of backlinks at the minute. I've already shown you some of the other links we've got. And you can see there's a direct correlation between the number of backlinks we've built over time, which you can see in this chart here, versus the amount of traffic that we're getting over time as well. So this process works. Links help you get more authority and that ranks your content better. It's very easy to automate. Should, should only take you a few minutes to do this. And I'm going to include all the prompts completely free in my chat GPT SEO course. Link is in the comments. And all you need to do is scroll down to the SEO link building section here. It's got some other tutorials on automating Harrow backlinks, podcast outreach, social media links, etc. Plus a bunch of other tools and AI SEO strategies that you can use to get more traffic. So thanks so much for watching. If you want to get more leads, traffic and sales from SEO, feel free to check out our coaching program where you get Q&A calls with me each week. Plus you get the actionable, simple steps to grow your traffic in a way that isn't overwhelming and you can actually get results based on what's working for me. So thanks so much for watching. Appreciate it. Bye-bye.